Hey everybody, we are here at the Guts and Glory uh, studio. What is it? Guts and Glory office, studio? What is the, what is the proper nomenclature? Studio. Studio here in lovely Oakland, California. We are about to watch the debate, but I figured I would go live right up until debate time. So if you guys have any questions. Did anybody else watch that, by the way? That was the most annoying, like, preamble thing that they did, where they just literally showed the, the, the pre-show right before the debate. Uh, just to let you guys know what is going on, uh, we are here at the Guts and Glory studio uh, so we can write our little mini expansion uh, for the contender, the game of presidential debate. So if you want all the best quotes from what is about to happen uh, in a little mini expansion that you can have in your game, we're going to write it all tonight. We are going to proof them all tonight. We are going to design them all tonight. We're going to send them to the printer. ASAP, so you can hopefully get it before the next debate. We're not going to make any promises, but that's what our goal, our goal is. As soon as it comes back from the printer, uh, you can go ahead and get that. Bit.ly slash debate pack. So bit.ly slash debate pack. There we go. Uh, the Battle for New York mini expansion is what we're going to call it. What do you think the American people will get out of the debate? Uh, I don't know. Something to watch on a Monday night, hopefully. <laughs> you know, it's going to be, I think it's going to be crazy. Uh, everybody, this has like the old big fight feel to it. There's, uh, there's definitely a lot of people uh, that are really, really excited for this. And by the way, Mark Cuban in the audience. Remember, this weekend, Donald Trump tweets out of Mark Cuban of failed benefactor fame, which is great that he remembers that. A lot of people might not have got that, but Donald, or sorry, Mark Cuban did a apprentice knockoff called The Benefactor, and Donald Trump will not let him forget about it, which is like just insanely petty and hilarious. True story, and that was in the tweet. And so Donald Trump says, I'll bring Jennifer Flowers, who for the you millennials was Bill Clinton's OG side piece. Uh, I don't know if Jennifer Flowers is here, but Mark Cuban is here. Uh, is Hillary's ambulance there yet? I don't know. But maybe when she leaves, she'll need a wambulance. It's a little joke. Might be a little tense out here. Uh, Cuban is a tool. Man, we got, we got some people out here that got some opinions about Mark Cuban. I've never been fond of the man myself because he, uh, he owns the Mavericks. And the Mavericks played the Heat in a couple finals. Uh, is Hulk Hogan there and whose side is he on? I don't know, Bobby the Brain here, and we're going to find out. Did Jill Stein get arrested yet? She did get escorted off the premises, as I read, because she did not have the proper credentials. By the way, I was credentialed for that debate. I could be in the press center for that debate, uh, but we didn't go. So, um, With a touch of gray, I know that you are a Hillary supporter. Well, I don't know. I mean, is it a touch of gray? It's kind of a streak of gray. I'm going very strategically gray. I don't know what that exactly says about my political leanings. Uh, Jamaican red stripe. Yeah, no, totally. Uh, who am I? Well, glad you asked. I'm Justin Robert Young. I do a bunch of podcasts, including a political podcast called Politics, Politics, Politics. Find it anywhere that uh, you find... Uh, you find the, the podcast there. Also, I'm an anchor on BitTorrent News, and I created a game called The Contender, the game of presidential debate, where you can indeed be like Hillary Clinton, be like Donald Trump, and debate each other. You can find that at thecontendergame.com. I'm, thank you for asking me. Uh, only Bill Clinton. Oh, also I do stickers. It's stickers or DIAF. Do we get a Mr. Tony LaCheeserie scream in the crowd tonight? I don't think so. I don't know. Why are you avoiding my question? Alan, so, tell me your question again. I, I, it's a hard time focusing on the text when I'm also, uh, you know, talking to you guys, trying to be entertaining for the good folks. The 700 people that are watching right now. Will Hillary pass out? I'm going to go ahead and guess no. If she passes out... On stage at the debate, I don't think she should be the Democratic nominee on Monday. Or Tuesday. It is Monday. Um, I will smoke a lot of drugs while I watch the debate. Well, hey man. We're from Oakland. 
we are very tolerant of any and all ways to watch the debate. Uh, where's the blunt? I don't know. Who uses blunts these days? Uh, do you think that there will be booing? No, no, no. We actually just watched... Uh, we, we, we just watched that very, very boring preamble where they made sure that they warned the audience to not clear, not, not cheer, not clap, not do anything. Uh, Dr. Bird for president. We are now eight minutes out, according to CNN. So we will, I'm going to have to wrap up so I can tweet at Justin R. Young and at Contender Game. Uh, you know, uh, uh, I'll have to stop talking. So I'll be, I'll be doing that. Uh, will they argue about who's healthier? Uh, Frankie DePug says uh, because the entire crowd would go uh, pro-Trump. I don't know, man. I mean, listen. Who knows? I mean, Mark Cuban probably wouldn't because he's a failed benefactor fame. What liquor can one drink tonight every time Trump says something racist without dying? I don't know. Maybe a beer you'd buy in Utah. Uh... <laughs> uh, man, a lot of political opinions here. Uh, what are your hopes with this debate? I'm so glad you asked. I hope we get a lot of really good quotes so everybody can buy the brand new expansion for the Contender game, which can be found at bit.ly slash debate pack. If you don't know what the Contender game is, go ahead and look it up on Amazon. Find us on our own, well, own website, thecontendergame.com. Are we getting live commentary? No. I got to work on this contender thing so I can't do live commentary. Um, that and also, I don't know. Live commentary on, on, on real debates are, are kind of tricky. The stakes are huge for Trump. Yeah, well, listen, they're, they're strong for both. This is a dead heat. Five weeks away from the election. So again, guys, uh, make sure you follow on Twitter at Contender Game. Okay, uh, we'll be tweeting all the best lines from the election right there, all the best one-liners, uh, and then go ahead and uh, check out at Justin R Young on Twitter if you want funny, silly commentary. Any BitTorrent news uh, info? Yeah, if you have BitTorrent news, you can watch the debate. Uh, it's going to be live without commentary, but you can watch the physical debate on BitTorrent News. Is it probably streaming online somewhere? Go, Jury. Well, you go, Oz Jester. I'm on your side. Uh, can Hillary last 90 minutes without a bathroom break? We're going to find out. Maybe she's got one of those little lady uh, pee things. Are you uh, secretly hoping Trump will come unglued tonight? I'm not so secretly hoping that somebody says some crazy stuff tonight. That's what I want. I want to sell card games based on them saying crazy stuff. That's my actual rooting interest tonight. Bill Clinton making his way to his seat right now. We are watching here on CNN's live feed. Can you do a wrap-up after the debate? Yeah, I'll tell you what, man. I would love to, considering we got... 800 people here. Uh, this seems like a good, uh, a good, a good place to talk. So how about this? Uh, we're gonna wrap it up here now. Again, uh, the Contender Game. Go ahead if you already own the Contender Game. It is bit.ly/debatepack. D e b a t e p a c k. Go ahead and get that mini expansion available now. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Well, Trump mentioned that he's a WWE Hall of Famer. We can only hope. Uh, there we go. Bit.ly slash debate pack. See you later, guys.